being an agent is just a really special opportunity to help people. Like when I think about basketball as a platform, I think of it like dominoes. If I help this player, I'm helping that community, I'm helping that family, and their outreach can be so huge depending on how well I'm able to do my job. A lot of players don't get to use their platform the way they want to and to be able to affect people in the way they want to, and that's what I want to be able to do. So three months ago, I got certified as an NBA player agent. It's something that nobody in Newfoundland, where I'm from, has ever done before. So I didn't have very much guidance and I had to figure it out myself. Um, thankfully, there's a lot of people that helped me out along the way and I'm optimistic that it's gonna be a bright future. I think it's really important, not just for women to work in the sports industry, but for diversity just to be at the forefront right now because different people respond to different people better. Everybody has a different upbringing, so some people respond better to a woman, some people trust women more, um, some people trust maybe a, an East Coaster more, <laughs> or at least I like to think so. So I just think that diversity makes there's space for everybody. So my role with Guelph is really special to me. I get the opportunity to help players learn things that they want to know. So at the beginning of the season, I took the time to speak to each player, see what they feel like they need to work on and what areas they feel like they could improve. For some players, it's their mental game. Some players, they need to eat better. They need to sleep better. Some people just really enjoy spending time with children and being a mentor. And I think for somebody to perform the best on the court, they need to have all the tools they need off the court as well. And of course, I love playing in practice and warming up with the guys. I played as a kid um, up until university, so it's really great to get on the court with them as well. Men's game, it's, it's very flashy. There's obviously a ton of athleticism, um, but I find in women's basketball, they're a lot more poised and they're even tougher than the men. I think that <laughs> there's a lot of things that could cross over into both sides that would make everybody's game more exciting, but the strategy on the women's side is just top notch. 15 years from now, I'm going to be a GM in the NBA. That's one of the very important reasons why I wanted to take the agent route, but also I want to have the player's perspective. I want to have the coach's perspective, and that's why my experience with FIBA is so important as well. For me, a lot of it was caused by having extra time to think during the pandemic, to be honest with you. I think it's kind of fate in a way. I think you find what you're meant to do based on the interactions that you have with people. And I kept finding people that told me that I should work in basketball and, and there's a pandemic and nobody's playing. The easiest route to take is create your own job and that's what being an agent was for me.